Vitamin C is critical and essential for human survival. Loss or low levels of vitamin C or deficiency of vitamin C causes a disease called scurvy. Vitamin C is essential for the human body. It is responsible for growth, development, repair of body tissues and also has a role in the body's immunity. Vitamin C is important as an antioxidant. It is good to destroy certain harmful substances in the human body. Vitamin C is a life preservative vitamin and that you have to take it on a regular basis otherwise you develop serious sicknesses. Loss or low levels of vitamin C or deficiency of vitamin C causes a disease called scurvy. Vitamin C is a water soluble vitamin. We require about 50 to 90 milligrams of it per day. A single orange can provide us our daily requirement of vitamin C. Foods rich in vitamin C, all citrus fruits, lemon, amla, tomato, cabbage, cauliflower, green and yellow and red bell peppers, spinach, so as you can see, vitamin C is readily available in our natural food and there is rarely any reason for us to supplement it. If you are in doubt, you can always go for a vitamin C assay to tell you whether you are deficient, in which case you may need to take a supplement. Otherwise, it is not necessary to supplement yourself with vitamin C. There is no extra benefit to your body. Tablet Selen. Tablet Selen is tablet vitamin C, 500 mg of vitamin C. You must remember, Taking tablet selen is for those who have vitamin C deficiency. It is a supplement for those who are deficient in vitamin C. It is not something to be taken to boost your immunity because it's not going to work that way. It's a water soluble vitamin. If you take in excess, it will get washed off. You must also remember that vitamin C overdosage, though not very serious, but does have problems because you will develop loose motions, diarrhea, stomach upset, acidity, nausea, and these are problems with excess dosage or overdosage of vitamin C. With over 1 lakh medical experts and the facility to teleconsult, experience clinic-like consultations on practice.